It's very common nowadays for us to be using some calendar app to manage our daily lives, our tasks, to-dos, schedules and more. For myself, I personally use Google Calendar which syncs with my Gmail, Google Drive, Google Meet and more and everything Google. If you use Google Calendar like me and many other Google applications, today I will show you how to easily schedule a Google Meet meeting using your Google Calendar. First, go to meet.google.com Click on New Meeting and select Schedule in Google Calendar. A new tab will open up and you can see the options to add to your calendar. So now you can key in your essential details like title. For example, I will put in maybe Steph's test meeting. The time zone is automatically set to where your location is for. So for me, it's here in Singapore. If you want to set it to other time zones in the world, you can select from the drop down here. Then key in the start date and time of your meeting and the end date. If the meeting is to be held for the whole day, you can check the box here for all day and automatically they will block out the whole day for your meeting. Next, you can select if this is a one-off meeting or if it will repeat in the future. So if this is a recurring meeting, you can click on the drop down and select the option for daily, weekly, monthly and so on. You can key in the location here, but usually for online meetings, you can leave it blank. Then you have the option to let Google notify you prior to this meeting in case you forget about it. So maybe you can set it to one day before or a few hours before the meeting starts. Select the calendar that you want to schedule this meeting for. From the drop down, you can see the list of calendars that you have. So for example, for myself, I have three calendars, my own, family and the one for my work. The color option that you select here will be reflected on your calendar. Under description, you can key in some details if you want to briefly describe what the meeting is about. You can also add an attachment from your Google Drive by clicking on the attachment icon here. This is useful for example if you are holding say a sales update meeting and you want your attendees to take a look at the sales report for the month or you can attach the meeting agenda for them to take a look prior to attending the meeting so they know what to expect for the meeting. On the right column here, you have the guest option. Here you can add the guest emails to this email invitation and all those in this email list will be sent an email informing them of the upcoming scheduled meeting. As for guest permissions, you can allow your guests to modify the event which we usually don't so it is left unchecked and you can let guests, invite other guests, or see the guest list. Once you're done and satisfied with the settings of this Google Meet, go on to click save and you're done. So as you can see, it's pretty easy to schedule a Google meeting in your Google Calendar as a lot of the Google applications are integrated. I hope you've learned something from today's video and if you find today's video useful, don't forget to subscribe for more content like this in the future. For a full guide on how to use Google Meet, you can head on over to the link in the description below. Until the next video, thanks for watching. I'm Steph. Take care and bye-bye.